Hi everyone, I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be for Aries, okay? Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, so I know guys, I'm I'm a little late on you guys' this reading. I definitely do apologize about that guys, but definitely been getting an overflow in uh, the personal reading department. <laughs> so I've just been trying to balance everything out. Y'all know I'm not going to forget about y'all. My channel is definitely top priority, okay? I'm just trying to find a way to balance everything out. All right, so let's see what messages we got. If you're new to the channel, come on in, come on in. We'd love to have you here with us. And you can go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. You're not going to want to miss out on future videos, okay? As well, really quick, guys. So... This is a new product that is coming to the website, okay? This is an energy clearing spray, okay? So I know a lot of people have been talking about that they can't burn sage or they can't burn their Palo, Palo Santo where they are, like in your office or in your car, when you're around, you know, just in, you know, not in your home. And some people, even while they're in their home, they just don't like to the smoke. I have a solution for you guys, okay? So this product is definitely smokeless, okay? It has uh, sage, um, Palo Santo, it has uh, Florida water, a mixture of things that you could utilize, that you would normally normally utilize to clear energy, and a few other things in it. You have, you guys will have to see when you purchase, okay? When it's available on the website, which you will be in a few days. And, you know, I did put a few extra things in here to give it that oomph, okay? But it's a really great product, guys. And the thing that I love about this product is that when I'm in my car, or I'm just like, you know, around people and I just feel like their energy is, you know, a little off when they walk off. Yeah, let me clear that up. Get that away from me. <laughs> Get that energy away from me because I don't want it. You can take your energy back, you know. But this product is amazing, guys. Like, I literally, I love this product, okay? And like I said, I had to make it because it was a lot of people just like, you know, I want to get the Sage bundle, but... I can't burn sage where I'm at. I live at home with my parents, you know, woo, woo, woo. And I'm like, oh, no, we're going we gonna to handle that. <laughs> we're going to handle that. So this product is great for that, for that reason. Um, as well, like I said, it will be available on the website. Um, within the next few days, I'm going to let you guys know when it is available. Um, but, yeah. This is amazing, guys. It's, and I'm going to make it affordable for everybody to purchase. Um, use this in your office, in your home, um, anywhere. You can pretty much use this anywhere. All you got to do is just, you know, it has a lemon scent, like a, a wake-me-up scent. Uh, it has Florida water in it, so, you know, it has that lemony scent, you know? I love it. I absolutely love this product. Okay. So back to it, guys. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's get into this read. Okay. I'm going to pull this down so you guys can see the cards. I like for y'all to see the cards. Okay. So Aries, let's talk, guys. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, South Node, Jupiter, all of that. <laughs> Give me a, a reading for Aries, please. What do Aries need to know what's coming towards them? The Five of Pentacles wanted to jump out, and the Queen of Pentacles wanted to jump out as well, too. So some of you guys could be um, focusing on your finances. Like, your finances are, you know, top priority here. Give me a message for Aries. We'll stop right here. Ooh, Four of Wands. Okay, so, ooh, and the Knight of Wands. The Ace of Wands. What is this? Normally when I see the Knight of Wands and the Ace of Wands, I'm thinking about some sexual energy. Like this is like a, a fling kind of type energy. <laughs> but let's see. The Four of Wands is a home or a marriage or a community. So let's see. The Fool. Knight of Pentacles. Knight of Swords, Lovers. Some of you guys could be dealing with the, the another Aries, 
or a Gemini or a Capricorn. Oh, wow. What's going on? We got Aquarius here. We got the star card here. Three of Wands, the Page of Swords, and the Four of Pentacles. You guys may be dealing with some type of heartbreak or sorrow. For some, this is a separation because we did have that Four of Wands here at the bottom of the deck, which, you know, could talk about a marriage here. This could be, um, let's see, let's get, let's find out what's going on. This Fool card, like, do, are you guys feeling like a fool? Because I'm getting like, very guilt or regretful energy here. Why is the fool here? The fool is risky. And especially with that with this knight of swords here, that's letting me know that it's some risky. Oh gosh, the moon and the five of wands. Somebody this is somebody who has an ulterior motive. There's hidden agendas. There's a hidden agenda here. Wow. We're going to leave that to the side. Yeah, look at this. Nine of Wands and the Page of Pentacles. It's like watching what you say. Or be careful what you ask for. The Strength card. Ooh. This is like really strong energy. Knight of Swords. Ooh, that jump. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups and the Knight of Swords. Somebody could be asking for a favor, asking for money. But somebody's inviting some type of... Uh, uh, somebody's inviting some type of energy in. Nine of Wands. Like I said, like... I'm hearing... I'm even hearing, stop calling me. Don't call me... Uh, don't reach out to me. Like, I'm getting really bold energy from you guys. But I feel like there was some type of conflict here that maybe that you didn't know about. That was something that was a secret that pissed you off here. And I'm getting, I'm hearing, don't call me. Don't call me when things get crazy and out of hand. The Seven of Cups. There is definitely confusion here. Look at this. Nine of Cups, Six of Pentacles, Seven of Wands, Five of Swords. There could have even been a physical altercation here. Maybe you want to beat the crap out of somebody. Like this person made you so mad. There could have been even there could have even been a physical altercation here. These cards are jumping. Yes, yeah, somebody's juggling. You may have found out that somebody's juggling. And now this situation is so burdensome. It's like, yeah, I'm going to keep it moving. I'm good. I'm going to keep it moving. This is like, you are so serious about this. Like, it's, it's, it's over. It's done with. Like, whatever somebody has pulled, whatever game somebody has been playing, I'm getting somebody playing mind games. Look, somebody here is stressed out. Somebody here is stressed out because somebody here is juggling and needs to make up their mind. Three of Swords. This could be a third party here. Queen of Wands. Yeah. There could have been a third party here. Possibly a King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn involved, or a Libra with the Justice card here. But I'm hearing like some, some type of karma or get back. Ooh, somebody's giving somebody money or giving somebody doing a favor for somebody. When somebody found out here that they were a part of a third party situation. Okay, now somebody here is having regrets. Ooh, feeling re very regretful. Okay, that they let this person borrow this money or gave somebody some money or help somebody in some way, shape, or form. Um, ooh, the star here. Oh, yes, yeah, see, you found out the truth. The truth came out possibly about an Aquarius or uh, you're hoping that the, the whole truth is exposed. Okay, you want something to be exposed. There's a temporary, oh, somebody got a fling. Somebody's messing around. For sure, for sure. 
Ten of Cups, Knight of Wands, Ace of Wands. This is a fling. This is like a temporary or a strictly sexual connection here. And the truth, you want the truth to come out, okay? Like I said, somebody could have been married or already living with someone. Um, the world, this could have been like a long-distance relationship. This person over here that you're dealing with, they're waiting for you to say, you know what, look, I'm cutting you off financially. Don't call me. Don't ask me for nothing. They're waiting for you to reach out to them. Um, ooh. This person feels like, you know, they got something new going on. They got their finances together or they're trying to get their finances together. So they're very, very like conflicted. They're 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 ready for action too. Okay. Somebody could even be flirting or somebody could possibly even be pregnant. Um this person is like I feel like this person feels like hey, they they were trying to get to the point of opening up and communicating with you to talk about this but i'm getting like somebody could possibly even be getting a, a divorce somebody could be filing some paperwork to get a divorce or to get to be separated because somebody here could have been having financial issues or somebody somebody has some issues with someone's family or something like that but you you're spying on this person you've been spying on this person but you want this person to see what it's like Kids could be involved Yeah, children could be involved It could be three children that could be involved But I'm getting like, you want to see what, You want this person to see what it's like I feel like Yeah, see, look at this, Seven of Swords You don't find out that this person is a liar That this person isn't being honest and you, I feel like you don't want to be patient with this person anymore. You have, you have, you've done what you can do. But I still feel like the outcome being the four of pentacles. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, you've been holding on to this person for so long. You've been holding on to the situation for a while, but I feel like you're, you're moving on now. You're ready to, to let this go. You're moving on. And you're ready for something new, okay? For some of you, you're moving out. You're finding a new home, a new place. Some of y'all have just got a new home or a new place. Like, I feel like you you are holding on to it, but you're, you're, you're over it. It's done. It's done. You found out the truth, and now it's over. It's, it's a wrap. Hey, it is what it is. If you guys enjoyed this reading, be sure to leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to uh, like share with your family and friends and subscribe if you are new if you're interested in booking a personal that information is in the Dropbox below and guys go ahead and check out the website it's a lot of goodies over there for you guys and you can utilize code sell 20 at checkout to get 20% off of your order all right until next time you guys ciao for now